I'm going to use a case statement to calculate how many days are there in a specific month. So the user is going to select the month, and then, then I'm going to the program is going to display how many days are in that specific month. I'm going to use a spin edit for the user to select the month. Let's put the min value to 1. Let's set the max value to 12 because there's only 12 months and the user can only select a value between 1 and 12. I'm going to display the number of days in a label. So it must be on the on click event of the button. Case okay, spin edit one dot value. Value is an integer and integer is an ordinal data type so we are allowed to use it in a case statement so if it's month four six nine and eleven then i'm gonna set label one dot caption equals to 30 days of course that's the months that only have 30 days okay then month one three five seven eight and 12 so if the value is 1, 3, 5, 7, 8, 10 or 12 then I'm going to use this label caption display 31 days if the user selected month 2 then it, that means it's February and we'll only have 28 days ok let's run the program ok I'm not able to change the spin edit value ah oh, max value max value should not be max length it should be max value is equals to 12 min value 1 min value 1 and max value 12 so I'm going to select 4 that should display 30 that's correct let's test it number 7 should display 31 and if it's February, that means number 2 is going to display 28. So it's a case statement. You must use ordinal value. Uh, ordinal, va ordinal value is like a char, boolean, or integer. Okay, so spin dot value is integer, so you are allowed to use it in a case statement. So it's number 4, 6, 9, 11. If it's one of these numbers, it will do this. Display the 30 in the caption of the label. If it's 1, 3, 5, 7, 8, 10 or 12, 
then it will display 31 in the label one dot caption if the value is 2 it's going to display uh, the value 28 in the caption of the label